What up guys, Kevin here. You want to know PlayStation's favorite restaurant? Their favorite restaurant. It's Fuddruckers. Because they spread so much FUD. Twice today. Twice. And my day just started on Twitter. I don't know what else I'm going to see. <laughs> First it's uh, oh, actually Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 being a three hour campaign. Duh. <laughs> like, duh. Um, isn't that every year? Like, oh my god, it's two hours. Wasn't it like a year was like two hours? Here's three hours. Um, and then Xbox has Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 ads that you can't skip. Uh, just made a video on that. Uh, also called out PlayStation and Steam and even Nintendo because they do the same thing. They've been doing the same thing, but again, Xbox does it. It's now a problem. Now, the weirdest FUD here is... <laughs> Uh, most Microsoft employees will, re will reportedly soon lose access to a perk of the job that offers them a free Xbox Game Pass Ultimate subscription. <laughs> that's that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. We went, you know, we, we went after PlayStation and Sony uh, for laying off Bungie. Uh, a lot of bungee workers this week. And now PlayStation fanboys are like, oh, look, they're getting rid of uh, Game Pass for their employees. <laughs> All right. I mean, w which company would you rather be? Bungie just got laid off or Microsoft. And now you got to pay 10, 15 bucks a month for Game Pass. <laughs> they're taking a perk away. Uh, do, does PlayStation, do they get a PlayStation Plus Extra whatever? Do they? I don't know. <laughs> All right. So, and, and apparently, I guess, Phil Spencer didn't know about this, and I guess he's going to step in and might do something about it. And, of course, then the crazy takes is like, oh, my God, look how they're pumping up the numbers here, giving uh, over 200,000 people uh, access to Game Pass. Like, okay, take it away. What was Still going to be, what, 30 million, whatever it is. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, employees are pissed. I would be pissed. I'd be like, hey, man, taking shit away from me. I mean, you don't want things taken away from me. But looks, let's look at the bigger picture here. Again, I'm not saying they should, you know, be happy just to have a job, even though I am. I'm always happy I get to go to a job. I'm going to a job right now, one of these big companies, and any day can be my last, I don't think it would be my last day today, it's Friday, I don't think they lay people off on Fridays, I don't know if they do layoffs, but I'm happy that I have a job, and here's the thing, here's the thing about most of us, most of us don't work at a company that has Game Pass, or has a perk that we actually want, I don't think my company has any perks that I really want, um, in terms of like, oh, here's something for free we can give you. I don't believe they have that. I don't. Um, when you work at Xbox, I don't think they understand this. Like, oh, yeah, we're Microsoft. We make all these great products. Why are we giving it away for free? <laughs> Most companies don't have products that employees want um, or can really use in an entertaining way. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> let's just align ourselves with every other company that doesn't have uh, free gaming subscriptions to provide for their employees. And I bet there's other perks that they get. It's Microsoft. Um, and especially when you work at Microsoft, I hear good things. I hear really good things working there. I assume they take care of their employees. Minus taking away Game Pass. Um, Microsoft seems like one of those companies you could put in you know, 20, 30 years and be set for life. Might not be rich, rich, but I bet you they have a decent 401k. I bet you they have some decent health benefits. Um, I don't know. Now I'm going to be a Microsoft employee in the comments. Yeah, yeah it sucks. <laughs> um, well, first, before you comment, look at other companies and let me know. What's the 401k matching? I bet you it's like 6% at least. Um, but yeah, this is just this is fun. Like, well, why do I care? <laughs> I don't work for Microsoft. And 
I would still work for Microsoft knowing that they're taking Game Pass away. I think that would be the least of my problems. Oh no, I gotta pay 10, 15 bucks a month for Game Pass. And yeah. Yeah. What what was the take I saw? Oh yeah, they need to collect that Call of Duty money, mine Activision Blizzard money somehow, making two hundred thousand people pay for Game Pass. A lot of people are probably not even gonna use it or sign up. So I think all 200,000 people are like rushing home to turn on their Xbox to play Game Pass. No, no. Um, but yeah, it's in a week where Bungie laid off like over 100 employees. Um, yeah, this is like the least of it. This is like like a little, little, little tiny like ankles it. Like, ah, crap, I got this uh, little ankle zit. They're getting rid of a game pass here. Um, yeah, so let's uh, divert our focus back to Bungie, who put out an atrocious statement. <laughs> oh, we need to earn your trust. Like, well, I mean, you can make the game good, but yeah, don't. I will never understand. Hey, we just laid people off, but we're just going to give you an apology and make sure everything's all right. Like, who's reading that? Going, oh, it's okay, Bungie. You did a statement. Bungie, you did a statement saying you, you acknowledge. You acknowledge that you're you're not doing too hot right now. So it's okay. It's okay, Bungie. You acknowledged it. I hate that sh- so much. Like, they would have been better off just shutting up. Like, all right, we laid off 100 people. Let's just shut up and get to work. That's what you do. You don't put out a statement just to acknowledge it. You know, I like when people acknowledge when they F up, but no, I don't, I mean, you're going to lay people off no matter what. <laughs> like, it's not an accidental layoff. Like, oh, accidentally hit that button, laid off 100 people. No, you you went in with um, full force and relentlessness to uh, lay off 100 people. But, yeah, let me go put out a statement saying everything's uh, going to be all right. We're going to acknowledge it and do better. <laughs> I can't be the only one that hates that shit. All right, I got to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you later. Later.